out to support the football team, UMass. We got a big game at UNH, and we got to get tailgate. Got to get after it. Is this one of the biggest games of the year? Absolutely, it is. It's got to be the biggest. What you got in your hand there, brother? Pass blue ribbon and a and a hot dog. You guys have been tailgating a lot today. Yeah, been here about three hours. Three hours. Um, what are you guys cooking up over there? Any specials? Hot dogs, burgers, standard fare. We got some burgers and dogs. We got some mesquite wood chips or something. Right now, we uh, got a nice little Weber grill there, some Kingsford charcoal, and uh, some fine uh, American beef, and uh, some, some brewskis. We got some dip, hot dogs, burgers, good stuff. You guys been, been hitting, hitting the drink? Yeah, a little bit. Got Only a tailgate of the year. Really? Only one we're coming out yeah. for. Yeah. Why? Why is that? Seems like a big game. It is a big game. Does the, does the time of the game, you think, affect a lot of kids in terms of them not showing up? It needs to be later. Yeah. We had to get up at 8 a.m. for this. That's too early. You got a lot of kids here who just drink hardcore on Friday night. They can't wake up at all on Saturday morning. If the game was at least a couple hours back, you'd have at least 5% more of the student body here. What do you think of the new tailgating restrictions in terms of making people go in the game once the game starts? Uh, I'm not a real big fan of tailgating restrictions because, I mean, if the people want to stay out here and grill and drink, you know what, that's fine. This is America, damn it.